IAQ Clarified, brought to you by the Indoor Air Quality Association, provides helpful consumer-focused tips on indoor air quality topics. Here is another tip from IAQA training provider, Ian Cull. Hi, this is Ian Cull bringing you an IAQA tech tip on fireplaces. Everyone loves the warm glow of a fireplace on a cold night, but is a fireplace a good way to heat a home? Well, it depends on the type of fireplace. Most fireplaces draw heated room air into the fireplace. For every parcel of air from the room that gets drawn into the chimney, a similar parcel of cold outdoor air will be drawn indoors, commonly leading to overall colder air temperatures. Sure, the fire will radiate heat and warm nearby objects, but heat from the room air will be lost up the chimney. To reduce the loss of heat, some have opted to use unvented fireplaces. They typically burn natural gas instead of logs of wood, but all the combustion gases enter into the room, posing indoor air quality concerns. These ventless fireplaces are very popular, especially in high-rise condominiums where chimneys would be too difficult to manage. A study from the University of Illinois found 20% of unvented fireplaces caused levels of carbon monoxide that exceeded the Environmental Protection Agency's outdoor air quality standard of nine parts per million. The only fireplaces that minimize the impact of indoor air quality are those that are totally sealed off from the home. These direct vent, sealed combustion fireplaces will not affect the home's pressurization and they send all the combustion gases to the outdoors. When fitted with a blower, they extract more of the heat and deliver it to the room. So before you suggest a romantic fire for your next date night, first check to see what kind of fireplace you have. If you'd like to have a professional evaluate your home for indoor air quality concerns, such as carbon monoxide, please visit the IAQA website and click on the Find an IAQA Pro button on the homepage.